Hey guys, Pete Gray here. A couple of weeks ago I did a um, video on how to pollinate a passion fruit flower by hand. I'm just showing you two weeks of results, okay? Summertime in Melbourne, Australia. It's now December, two weeks in. Um, I'll just show you uh, all these flowers are starting to close up now. I self-pollinated those. Uh, using the pollen off the anther which is underneath and then on the stigma which is the three prongs there okay so they're all closing up after two days now I'll just show you finished products coming along nicely these are two I pollinated when I did the video they're now grown very very fast a really good fertilizer liquid fertilizer is perfect don't put it on the plant because you'll burn the leaves and you would burn the plant uh, it's pretty strong but put it around the base into the soil and you know any flowering plants around I find the citrus um, fertilizer actually works for everything really um, don't need to buy both but um, don't quote me on that just don't put it on the plant directly sprayed around the base every three months this is another area i did two weeks ago look at that two weeks hand pollination the technique i did in my last video um just go through my playlist and you'll see that these are all growing rapidly so all different stages you know it's great and the vine, I've had this for four months and it was literally, as I say, it was like two to three feet high, a good trellis, perfect, and it'll take over your whole fence. I'll go around that side of the fence too. I've gone around this side a bit and it's just growing. It's trying to grab onto anything it can. Um, here's some more, just here, smaller ones. Probably got about 16 passion fruits at the moment, and probably about another 10 or so flowers that are there. Here's one there. Just see, see that right there. I pollinated this earlier today. Just let this focus. So that will close up in about 24 hours like these ones up here and then we'll start doing its magic and hopefully this area here is going all across the across the whole bush here just to here fantastic another big one in there the biggest one down here it's fantastic with the price of passion fruit these days you end up like one one to two dollars for one passion fruit when you can buy a plant for fifteen dollars that's two and a half feet tall plant it in just before spring so in melbourne like plant it in august then or late july for good water um every day fertilize it um every three months and uh, you treat the plant with respect and it'll um, produce uh, lots of fruit for you. And you'll just keep flowering and it'll keep growing and the bigger and bigger it gets, the more fruit you actually get. It's absolutely stunning, delicious passion fruit. Um, you couldn't ask for anything more. Anyway guys, there's the proof two weeks of uh, after Fertilize, uh, sorry, fertilizing, well, similar technique. Um, Self-pollinating these flowers, now they're closing up. They'll start getting a bit heavier. Then you know that you get the passion fruit starting to grow inside. So, yeah, two weeks, uh, hand pollination. Watch my video. Um, please like, subscribe. Um, a lot of my videos are based on how to do things. Um, a few funny moments in my life. 
um, some top 20s experiences around the world. Uh, hope you find it interesting. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Cheers. Have a great night. Bye.